I am on a mission. My mission is to change the way that menopause is perceived and treated. A lot of women feel like they're a failure if they can't toughen it out. And the reasons I've heard women use before, well, my mother toughed it out, right? And she's alive to tell me about it. Also, women have been encouraged by other women to tough it out. It's almost like they're joining a club, you know. We're gonna, we're gonna make sure that you're strong and you're gonna get through this, you know, and you can do it, you know, and I've seen a lot of that. They've heard from their doctors that this is a natural process, you know, and at this point in time, you know, because of the Women's Health Initiative study, we have nothing to give you that's safe, okay? So, you know, you're gonna get through it, you'll be fine, and I'll give you your Prozac, or I'll give you your sleeping pills, or I'll give you your anti-cholesterol medications until you get through the whole thing, right? If I'm not, if I'm not toughing it out, and I do need to have some kind of you know, hormone therapy. The traditional prevailing view has been hormone replacement therapy, right? Okay. Which means treat with hormone drugs using the lowest dosages for the shortest amount of time, right? Now they're giving you a time frame of how long you can be on these hormone drugs. Okay. But I want you to know now that they're saying the same thing about bioidentical hormones, okay? So they're even saying, you know, use bioidentical hormones for the, you know, the lowest dosages for the shortest amount of time and just treat the symptoms of menopause, right? So they're still about treating the symptoms of menopause.